Hi guys, it's Katie Did here, and I am back with another review for you guys today. So today I'm going to be doing a review on the Chroma Artist Acrylics as well as the Chroma Acrylic Fluid Medium. According to the back of this, Chroma Acrylics are made with white fast pigments and 100% acrylic resin. They are formulated with the maximum pigment loading possible for each color and contain no fillers or extenders. Suitable for use by professional artists and craftspeople in a wide range of applications, Chroma Acrylics are light fast, water resistant, and flexible when dry. Then it says, apply to any non-oily surface, can be thinned with water or extended with acrylic mediums. Keep brushes wet, clean up with soap and hot water. According to the back of this, this is an archival quality artist material for use in a variety of applications and techniques including extending and glazing with acrylic colors. It dries clear, keep your brushes wet, and clean up with soap and water. It is their most fluid medium, gloss finish, dries clear, ideal for glazing, in collage, or for coating finished work. So I reached out to them and they sent me some goodies. Uh, so they sent us quinacridone magenta, phthalo blue, benzi yellow, and then this artist fluid acrylic medium in a 250 milliliter container. So now I'm going to show you the opacity of these on a strip of black, uh, like I normally do. But as you can see, they kind of test this out for you anyway, and as you can see, these are already pretty opaque, but I like to test it out so I can go ahead and see for myself how it's going to work. So let's get into that. Alright, so my basic black strip here, uh, it's just solid black, and I'm going to be painting over it to see how opaque or translucent these paints are. So first up is Quinacridone Magenta. Colors are so rich and pretty. Oh, do you see how beautiful it is? I love it, I love it, I love it. Next up is Benzy Yellow. And just because I'm thinking about it, I love these cute little caps. They're just so tiny. Oh, they're so cute. Sorry, random moment there. Look how pretty these colors are. They're so pigmented and rich. And last up is Thalo Blue. Oh, it's so pretty. I wish I was as rich as these colors are. <laughs> Not really funny. <laughs> so here are the colors. They're all swatched and beautiful. Um, they're not dry yet, but when they dry, they are pretty glossy. So they kind of already look wet when they're dry, but like I said, these are not dry. I just finished painting them. Um, but they're so pretty. I love them, and I can't wait to buy all of their colors. <laughs> Or at least a lot more because I really like these. Alright, so let's get into an illustration where I talk more about these amazing paints and more about their super awesome company. Alrighty, I had so much fun playing with these paints. They were a lot of fun to work with. And they're very fun to mix. Since they gave me the primaries cyan, magenta, and yellow, I was able to mix more vibrant colors than I would have had if I had had red, yellow, and blue, like everybody thinks are the primary colors, but... After all, it seems that cyan, magenta, and yellow are actually the true primaries, but I digress. Anywho, so I really am so thankful that Chroma let me try out their paints. It was a joy to work with. They're so fun to play with. So about these paints, they are made in Vancouver, British Columbia, which is in Canada, specifically on Granville Island. They are only sold online or at their home front store in British Columbia. They are handmade by a very small batch manufacturer, and they've been making colors, mediums, and gesso since 1970. They're super rich, thick paints, and they have amazing pigmentation. Their website, I will put it on the screen, is chromaacrylics.com, has very detailed info on each color, and it's very, very helpful. They sell their products at wholesale prices, so you don't have to spend a lot of money just for a name. You actually get really good paint for a wholesale price. If you live in the U.S. though, they will, probably anywhere else besides Canada actually, they do charge shipping and shipping is expensive, but if you're really into painting, I think it's the, ex you should go the extra mile. They're available in 60 milliliters, 125 milliliters, 150 milliliters, 250 milliliters, 500 milliliters, and 1.125 liters. So they come in a variety of sizes, and they dry with a glossy finish, and they're very, very beautiful. They produce a total of 45 different colors, and they have various sets that you can buy, like all of their colors. You can buy them in the classic set, an earth tone set, 
I mean, you can buy them in quite a few sets. And they also have dry pigment you can buy in, I think, every single shade that they make. Also, prices vary according to pigment and size, just as you would expect. So I did this painting, and every single color in this painting has been mixed by those three colors. So there have been no additives. The only thing that was added for fluidity was the acrylic fluid medium by them as well because I was reviewing that. I really liked how it mixed in with the paint and it did dry clear just like it said it would. I had no trouble making it fluid and I, it makes it dry flat too so if you want maybe like a set self leveling in your paint mix a little bit of that in it and it'll dry flat. If you want to purchase these I will leave a link down in the description below to where you can do so. I really hope you liked this video please give it a thumbs up if you did. Also, don't forget to leave a comment down below. Let me know what you'd like to see reviewed next. You can follow me on DeviantArt, Pagey World, Twitter, and Instagram. All of my links are down in the description below. And don't forget to join our super cute artist family if you haven't already. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, bye!